We're here with longtime parishioner in Rome, Peter Allegi, member of Santa Susanna and now St. Patrick's Parish. Peter, how long have you been part of the Paulist community? This month makes 50 years. Wow, exactly. 50 years. And um, you've been very instrumental in helping us with our difficulties in terms of the building at Santa Susanna and um, in terms of when it was closed for seven years and getting us back in there. So you've been a very good friend, a loyal person, a member of the Paulist community in so many ways. Well, the honors here go to the Paulists because your group through the years, people have changed, but the goodness towards the American community in Rome has not changed. Uh, you take care of a, a regular parish, you take care of a school, spiritual needs, and you take care of the Americans coming through, who are many. Uh, all, all this deserves honor. Well, we're very grateful to you and to your beautiful wife, Linda, and we thank you for um, accepting this Spirit of Hecker Award. You, know, you are most uh, deserving of it. Thank you. Thank you. On behalf of Newman Hall Holy Spirit Parish, we are proud to present the Spirit of Hecker Award to J.C. Orton, a parishioner who exemplifies the twofold characteristic of servant of God, Isaac Hecker, personal perfection and a zeal for souls. Like Isaac Hecker, J.C. has been a searcher for holiness. His love of Jesus led him first to the seminary. However, his protesting for justice would have gotten him into trouble with his local bishop, such as his arrest and imprisonment for protesting against the School of the Americas. He finally came out to lose his lumber company job. But God led him to a holiness of caring for the homeless in Berkeley, so he started Night on the Streets Catholic Worker. JC's zeal for souls leads him each morning to set up shop in downtown Berkeley to be a post office, banker, tax preparer, social security and section 8 consultant, and friend to the homeless. Newman Hall is honored and humbled to recognize JC Orton as this year's recipient of the Spirit of Hecker Award. Blessings. My name is Father Jamie Baca and I'm the director of the University Catholic Center here at UCLA in Los Angeles. This year we'd like to honor Gerard Convento with the Spirit of Hecker Award. He's a 2007 grad of UCLA and a very active member of our community. He's involved in the choir, in liturgy, in student retreats, and anything that we ask him to do, he does it with a smile. So he's a great gift to us. We want to say thank you, Gerard, and congratulations, and God bless you. This is a quotation from Isaac Hecker. Through the Holy Spirit, we receive all that is holy, good, true, and beautiful. And that comes from a larger quotation, which is Paula's favorite quotation, obviously about the Holy Spirit, because if you know Paula, she's all about Holy Spirit from the beginning to the end of her spirituality. And indeed, when she was a graduate student at the Weston School of Theology in Cambridge, she wrote her master's uh, thesis with distinction on the Holy Spirit, Church Authority, and the Individual Soul in it Selected Works of Isaac Thomas Hecker. And one of the great uh, things we look forward to here each year when our novices visit uh, Boston is uh, Paula's famous walking tour of Hecker and his Transcendentalist friends in Boston. For these and so many other things, and for her person in particular, uh, not just what she does, it was a no-brainer when Father Chuck Cuniff and I got together. Congratulations, Paula. Thank you ever so much. The Vero Beach Paulists honor Bill and Nancy Curtis with the Spirit of Hecker Award. They grew up in St. Augustine, Florida, where they were high school sweethearts. They've been married for 61 years. Both are now active members of Holy Cross Parish here in Vero Beach. The two recently became Paulist Associates, charter members of the new local associate group. The best description of Bill and Nancy can be taken from the 23rd Psalm. Surely goodness and mercy follow them wherever they go. Blessings on you, Bill and Nancy, and on your five children, 14 grandchildren, and two great-grandchildren. Mm -hmm.